Today we have a uh, flash memory device from a 2004 Volvo XC90. Um, this little guy right here, 44 legs. And what I'm going to do on this video is I am going to attempt to read it on the adapter for the AR32. Um, thanks. I just want to thank uh, Jared Gartha for uh, sending me this adapter to test on my AR32 and for the making of the video. Uh, with that aside, we're going to start. Now, according to... Um, According to the AR32, we have the configuration of the programming unit or the dip switch to down, 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 up, down, up, down, up. So I set it up already. As you can see, let me focus it right. Down, 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 on, I mean, down, 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 up, down, up, down, up. And this is the adapter. Precious thing. It's amazing. Okay. Uh, just so... You guys know. All right, so we're gonna start this little thing right here. Okay, let me focus. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna put the adapter on. We're gonna follow the directions on the adapter. Uh, see if I can get the light. Obviously, uh, people that know, this is our indication right here. And if you look at the adapter, I mean at the uh, target device, okay, you're going to see that the pin 1, as you can see it, let me see if, if I can, there you go, pin 1, right here, okay. Perfect. So we're going to put that in there. Got to be very careful. Okay, so the device sits there. Pin one matches pin one. Okay. By the way, this is my first time using this adapter. So, Oops, let me just double check real quick here. All right, connecting all legs. Great, and it's set already at five volts. So, I'm going to play it safe here. back in perfect okay so the target device is connected it's ready to go and we are gonna go to this interface right here focus okay so we're gonna go here Select number three. Yes. It's doing its thing. It's ready the device. Okay. In the meantime, I would like to say this is pretty interesting adapter. Has a jump switches. Right here has its power supply, whether it is one volt or low volt and five volt. Um, Lex protector. Maybe from for ground capabilities. And there you go. Perfect. So we're going to hit G here. And it's going to do its thing. It's just going to read it and verify it. I'm sorry. I had 
It's a little out of focus. I don't know why, but there you go. It's going to go through its cycle, and then we're going to go through it. Then I'm going to make another video on how to do the same thing with another tool, the famous prog. So right now it's just reading the part data into buffer. On the buffer editor, comparing the data, which is going to take a little, you know, it's going to take twice as much because it's comparing there, making sure that everything is, um, that it's reading and comparing the, the information that it, it got from the device into the device. And we have this. It's almost done. First time I read it, I was like, whoa, what in the world? What in the world? What is all this dollar signs? <laughs> uh, but I was able to get it. I sent it to my friend Jareth, and he used his uh, uh, programmer to, to see how many keys. Oh, there you go. Part and number, part and buffer match. Data indicate valid. All right, so this is just a quick video to know you can read using. I'm going down, and then the real data comes in at the line 800. All right, guys, thank you so much. This is just a quick video just to read this uh, target device. A flash target device from um, XC90, excuse me, 2004, using the AR32. Thank you, guys.